Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this error that is secure boot is not enabled. So if you're receiving this error with Battlefield 6 game on your Windows computer, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now for this, you have to enable the secure boot in system BIOS. Now before you make changes in system BIOS, you can read this. If you're not used to making changes in BIOS settings, contact your system manufacturer customer support because incorrect configuring BIOS settings can cause issues with your computer, including no boot issues. So you can even go through this EA article on EA website. Here you can see uh, how to use secure boot on your PC. And there is also a link for from Microsoft how to enable secure boot on my PC. You can go through this to enable the secure boot. First of all, check if the secure boot is enabled on your computer so you can type in ms info 32 in windows search box and then click on system information and over here you can check secure boot state if this is on or off if if it is off then you can turn it on in system bios you can also visit tpm dot type in tpm dot msc in windows search box and in my case uh, if you see compatible tpm cannot be found then Again, you have to make changes in the BIOS. Now, to make changes in the BIOS, go to the system BIOS. Now, for this, you can go to Windows settings, go to Windows update, and then go to advanced option, and scroll down, go to recovery option, and over here, you can see advanced startup. Click on restart now. Now, on this screen, go to troubleshoot option, and then go to advanced option over here, and then go to UAFI firmware settings, click on it, and then click on restart over here. Now uh, this will take you to the system BIOS. Now you can go to boot option. So in my case, it's boot configuration. And over here you can see the boot mode is set to UEFI. So make sure this is set to UEFI only. And then you can scroll down and find secure boot. So over here you can see uh, secure boot option. And the secure boot is off over here you can see secure boot is off now you can turn it on so you can just turn on the secure boot and then at the bottom you will see apply changes option so hit apply changes over here and then click on ok and then you can go to the security option now over here i have intel so it's showing Intel Platform Trust technology. This is the TPM 2.0. So you can turn it on. And then again at the bottom, hit apply changes. And then again click on OK. And then at the now you can exit. For AMD users, uh, AMD CPU FTPM Trusted Computing 2.0 should be enabled. So you can enable this and then restart PC. And after the system restart, you can launch the game and you should not receive this error anymore. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.